Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome to a, another Let's Make a Game kind of thing. I, um, I'm going to play in the background. No copyright sounds. What I did is I went to their main page, went to videos, play all. I'm just going to boom, hit that, and we're just going to play no copyright sounds in the background. That way I don't have to worry about it. Tonight, uh, I wanted to jump over into studio, and one of my most memorable buildings from like the movies of long past is the Terrell building of um, uh, Blade Runner. So, it, for those of you that don't know what I'm talking about, right here, uh, no, right here. All right, so the Terrell building is this massive, huge building. Not this, this is not it. This right here, that's a, that's a good idea. But there was this scale that I kind of wanted you to see that that we didn't realize the size that this thing is. Okay, that's that's not working. Why is that not working? Poop. Anyhow, um, so like this right here, that's the scale of the Terrell building. So I did a couple of little researches of um, oh there it is. So boop, 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 boop. come on, come on. There we go. The scale of the Terrell building. So there's the Great Pyramids there. About 125, 170, or 140 uh, stories tall, right? Uh, the, do, 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 where is it? The Eiffel Tower is about 350 stories tall with the, its with the pike. Stark Tower is almost 350 tall, so I guess that's 325. The Terrell Building is around almost 2,500 stories tall. It's massive. So like, this is this is the uh, Okay, from Lords of the Rings. You know the, the Sarah, 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 the, this guy. With the big eye, right? Like, it dwarfs that. That's how massive the, the tower is. Terrell building, okay? Uh, that's the Kingdom Tower. Anyhow, uh, I think the only one that goes higher than that is the Citadel, and it's, yeah, it's just past the 25, so 2,500 right there, that's its tallest point. Terrell Building's just shy of that, like 200, 300 stories. So, um, let's do this. How, how tall is a story? Uh, typically, uh, retail ceiling height, uh, the larger the space, blah, 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 small space is 1,500 feet, shelving, no, blah, 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 fixtures, 14 feet, story, how tall is a store, <laughs> story of a building, there we go, how tall is a story of a building, about 14 feet, so, uh, in scale, Inside Roblox, I'm inside my my uh, my thing here, and if I just go over to models, we'll just go to put a part down. I would say, all right, and this is just me talking out loud. A one by one by one part would be about a foot by foot by foot, I think. Um, let's see, where's size? So let's go to size. One come on, come on, right about like that. <clears throat> so about a foot by foot by foot. In comparison to an avatar, I would think. Let's put this uh, right down here. Wait, where did it go? Come here, you. I didn't say stop there. Where, where are you going? Link. So what I wanted to do tonight is kind of throw scale out here and give you an idea of what scale kind of looks like whenever you're, you're building inside uh, Roblox games. Uh, something happened there. That's not good. I, I think I made a script, didn't I? Didn't I make it where I could pick these up or something? I don't, I don't remember. Maybe it was this one? That doesn't work anymore. Hmm. I'll have to figure out what happened with those scripts. But, in comparison, right? We normally say like one foot by one foot by one foot, right? In comparison to that, I think I think that's about right. 
uh, if you were to take a one foot compared to like a human, like this is this is about a foot to me. Uh, that block to that avatar is about a foot. So, um, if we're going off of the Terrell building's feet, about 14 feet equals uh, one story. How tall is the Terrell building? 700, 700 stories tall. About six city blocks deep. So let's run calculator. So seven, what do what we say? 700 stories times 14, 9,800. So how, how large can we make this block? Let's see, uh, not position. Let's go size, uh, zero, no, we're, we're gonna go one, comma, nine, 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 comma, one. So, 2048. Woo. 2048. So that's about how tall it is. Oh gosh. <laughs> uh, actually, it's much taller than that. <laughs> are collisions on? Collisions are on. So let's move left and right. <laughs> wow. Okay. So let's let's kind of move this over. Move this down some. Maybe maybe this way just a little bit. There we go. So then, uh, let's go ahead and scale this, like that. Okay, so what, what was this, 2048, copy, paste. 2048, 2048, uh, bust out our handy dandy blues clues calculator again. Uh, divided by 2048, so I'm gonna need four of these. Copy, paste, copy, paste. Jeez. <laughs> oh, <laughs> All right, F to focus. <laughs> wow. Okay. So we're we're not even to the top yet. That's uh that's just four of them. What, what did we say? Uh, Control Z. Uh, nine eight zero zero. Uh, times. 0.7851. So seven. No, 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 no. Sorry. Nine eight zero zero. No, 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 oh, no, 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 no. I'm doing my math wrong. Two zero four eight because that's that's how big the piece can be. Times 0 0.7851. So sixteen. Zero one six zero seven one six zero seven. So about that. We're we're not gonna go for school full scale because the very accurate scale, I guess. What was that? Uh, one six. So where is the size again? Size right there. One six zero seven. Actually, I can just no, I I can't. I have to do it this direction. Ooh, one six zero eight. So it's about a foot off. Oh, come on, zoom, 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 zoom. Zoom. There we go. We have to come down by one, please, please. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> right there. That is the height of the Terrell building. <laughs> you know the, the sad part? I think I forgot to um, anchor these parts. <laughs> oh no. All right, let's zip back down to the bottom. Hold on. Click, click, click. 
Oh gosh. Oh gosh. All right. Can I click on this one? There we go. That'll work. All right. Let's go ahead and select all of these. That should be the five pieces. And we're going to... Okay, that's that's all of these, right? Yeah. So I should say Tyrell Wall. There we go. Let's just copy that. And we're going to paste. 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 There we go. So those those are all the Tyrell buildings and the walls. I should be able to anchor these. Go ahead and anchor, anchor, good. So let's just take a look to scale of what it looks like to my little avatar. What in the world? <laughs> so, and that's, that's not even including like how wide they are or the fact that they've got um, angles to them. So like, uh, here, uh, I have to turn off the sound, but this is, this is actually from the movie to kind of give you an idea, like how massively huge these are. So when you're building things that are supposed to be representing things that you make in movies or you, you're trying to recreate uh, that feel, I want you to understand the scale of things that they, they do inside movies. These fictional movies and stuff like that, it's just Harrison Ford, man. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> so, uh, let's do something interesting. This will be fun. Let's go ahead and come on. I'm, oh, I'm in world, aren't I? <laughs> I'm still playing the game. Hit stop. We're gonna grab this and Let's just go up here. Ah, oh, no. No! Okay. Maybe I'll just stretch it out for a little bit. That'll be fun. Okay, for those of you that are asking code, how are you how are you zipping around there so fast? So I'm dragging it upward, right? Wait, did I drag the right thing? Oh no, no, I'm scaling it now. I'm dragging it upward and then I'm pressing F to zoom in on it, to center it. Pull it up like that. Press F to recenter it. So there we go, there we go. Now I need to squish this back down to its original size. Kind of, kind of, maybe. There we go. So, this should be on the top layer, top level. There we go. So now, if I hit F5, when we play, that should be the opposite teleport that I need to get to. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, the teleport script can actually be found inside my book look look at me insert the the selfless promotion right here hold on where is it how to it's chapter seven chapter seven chapter seven that's chapter eight we need chapter seven teleport 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 port, port. oh no let's Hey, what? Lead by examples. Beam me up. There it is. There we go. So look, 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 look. I even have this example inside my book on how to create these teleport scripts. Um, by the way, the Advanced Roblox Coding Book. I know it says the Advanced Roblox Coding Book. Don't take that as like, oh, this is going to teach me extreme. No, it, this is to take you from like zero nothing you've never scripted before into, hey, you're going to be able to create a game after you're done. You can, you can create a game, you can create your own environment, you can script, you can program, you can build. All that stuff is taught in here. 
This book doesn't actually teach you, it teaches you how to learn. And basically, I want you to understand that I have ADHD and I would have always wanted a book like that to teach me how to do stuff like this. Oh, no! Demo failed. <laughs> uh, I guess it would help if I anchored the part, huh? <laughs> oh, goodness, that's funny. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> now it should be up there at the top. <sighs> so, now I should be able to jump on this blue part. Boom! There we go. Oh, my gosh. I am up at, at the very top of the Terrell building. This is how long it would take you to jump off the Terrell building. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, um, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you tonight was just the, the idea of like how massive scales are. Okay. So, if you're, if you're looking to create things to scale, all right, don't cut yourself short. A lot of people, what they'll do is they'll, they'll build and then they'll, they'll shrink it down because it's easier. If you're going to make the Terrell building, make the Terrell building and take the time to like, and there's, there's shortcuts to getting around certain things. Like you don't have to make every single layer. You can, you can put a texture on to make the, the layer look like it's got floors. There's always nifty little tricks and, and, and things that you can do to create this illusion that it's it's bigger than it actually is. I think I think that's that's it. That's all I wanted to tell you guys. That was only 17 minutes long. Um, let's go back to build. Now since we're doing to scale size, let's do let's do how wide was it? Um, with a general average of 14 feet. Okay, so if we if we go back down to the bottom, let's go down to the bottom floor. Oh, is that the bottom? All right, let's go back down to the bottom floor. And we are going to grab all the Terrell parts like that. And if we move, Oh gosh, that is hard to work with, isn't it? I forgot. Did I not grab that top one? Control Z. Ah, uh, that's why. Okay, here we go. Let's try and get it to touch the ground at least. There we go. That's nice. Okay, so how wide is the Terrell building? Each story is about high. Fictional buildings, how tall? Okay. Uh, and six city blocks deep. 700 stories tall, six city blocks deep. What does that mean? What does that mean? Like side to side? Uh, okay. How how large is one city block? Okay, city blocks differ in size. The square city block reaches 16 to 17. Wait, city blocks block reaches 16 or 17 per mile, or about 2.21 or two two 2.5 acres. Engineers typically <coughs> Use a typical city block as 100,000 square feet for calculations, which is about 17 blocks per mile or two and one fourth acre. That's confusing. What's the average length of a city block? About 2.5 acres or 2.2 acres. So it could be anything. Who knows? I love measurements. So let's, let's just go off this. Engineers typically use a, t a, a city block as 100,000 square feet. So 100,000 square feet it is dimension times dimension. 
So I guess that would just be the square root of 100,000. Square root? No, nope, that's just, what is that? Come on. Square root. 316. 316 feet? Is that right? 316 feet. So what did we say? Uh, let's go Terrell building. Uh, that's position size. There we go. 316. So the x axis is 3. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on. Let's grab all of these. We gotta grab our that one down there. 316. Come on, size. Oh gosh. Now that I've changed it. <laughs> okay, hold on. 316. And what did they say? Um, go back. It's about six of those. So 316 times six. 316, 16 times six. 1,806. 1,800. Does that sound right? That doesn't sound right. Because if that's right, then... Oh, was that position or was that size? This is the first Terrell wall. Size is 316. Wait, what? Oh, it's trying to put a comma in there. Ha ha ha. There we go. There we go. That's about how wide it is. Whew. Now, the other thing is it is at an angle, so I don't I don't know if the tallness is included in the angles or if it's not here I, I'm actually going to move this off just a little bit oh my gosh <laughs> what is this music seriously come on come on come on How about we not get another drink? Because this is a family-friendly channel, and we're we're not talking about going to the clubs. Hold on, hold on. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. What's the next one? Free fall. Walk away. Hold on. Sorry. Sorry. My apologies. Oh, that's a good game. That, that, that's a good, good one. Okay. Okay. Jump in here. Okay. That should, that should be fine. Well, let's, uh, let's go here, and that's the top one. Let's go down here. So there's the bottom of the Terrell building right there through that little gap. This shows you how wide the Terrell building would have been. And that up there shows you how tall the Terrell building would have been. So uh, I will leave this inside my Code Primate Labs so you guys can see it. See the scale of the massiveness that I'm talking about. And just, I don't know. The, I, I think what kind of bugged me is I was over here seeing stuff like this, like the Come on, where did that go? Like the propane tank, all right? Hold on, can we get it back down there, please? So I was seeing the propane tank, and I'm like, is that really to scale? And it's, it's not just that, it's like, 
I remember whenever I was little, trying to uh, climb on top of my propane tank back at my old, 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 old house when I was like nine years old. And I'm like, that's not to scale. I would never have been able to like climb up that. This is not to scale. If I am a full adult human, right? This is way too big. This is not the size that a propane tank should be. I mean, it should be more like, um, like here. Hold on, can I, can I hit stop? Can we do scale? Control shift. Like that. Maybe like that. Basically, uh, it, well, for anybody that's like watching my videos for the first time, this is more like a promotional video for, for my book. Absolutely. And it's so I could get in here and actually play in studio for a, a second. And a lot of you have been asking, Code, where is your lumber games? Where's where's your Code's lumber, my lumber? I haven't been working on them. I really haven't. I've completely like stopped developing on games and kind of engrossed myself in RPA, which is Robotic Programming Analytics. No, Robotic Process Automation. <laughs> Which is what I've been doing at work, and it's it's pretty much taken over all of my programming programming time. So, uh, making videos at nighttime is still something I would have been doing anyway. So, I thought, you know, why not jump in here, have some fun, encourage you guys to go build, but build to scale, and give you an idea of like what to do. If you have not seen my uh, how to make a game series, highly encourage you to do it. I highly encourage you buy my book. Okay, and I'm also going to tell you. Go look up the master dev. I'm also gonna tell you, go look up uh, Alvin Blocks. I'm gonna shout those guys out. If you're looking to start creating your own games, to start making money at DevX, do it. You can do this, okay? It's, I promise. Programming is not as hard as it looks like and the scripting part is probably going to be 30% of everything that you do in making a game. Oh, that worked. Okay, why did that all of a sudden work? Hello. Oh. It's going to wherever my mouse cursor is. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> so, like, my mouse cursor is over there. Hey, I'm actually happy that it worked now. Anyhow, let me get out of here. Uh, love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the, the series, at the end of the videos, like a good YouTuber does. Uh, if I happen to go and actually create the Terrell building, I will turn it into a model and save it to, uh, to the toolbox so you guys can use it. It's a massive scale thing. I'm not sure I'm going to do it. <laughs> I might make a, a mini Terrell building, a mini. You know, and I'll, I'll put in there, not to scale. <laughs> After I just got tell, done telling you guys, make it to scale. <laughs> Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we will talk to you very soon. Outro. <laughs> <laughs>